Hashed Audio presents David and Goliath, Underdogs, Misfits, and the Art of Battling Giants, written and read by Malcolm Gladwell. For AL and SF, a real underdog. Introduction Goliath But the Lord said to Samuel, Do not look on his appearance or on the height of his stature, because I have rejected him. For the Lord does not see as mortals see. They look on the outward appearance, but the Lord looks on the heart. 1 Samuel 16.7 Am I a dog that you should come to me with sticks? 1. At the heart of ancient Palestine is the region known as the Shephelah, a series of ridges and valleys connecting the Judean mountains to the east with the wide, flat expanse of the Mediterranean plain. It is an area of breathtaking beauty, home to vineyards and wheat fields and forests of sycamore and terebinth. It is also of great strategic importance. Over the centuries, numerous battles have been fought for control of the region because the valleys rising from the Mediterranean plain offer those on the coast a clear path to the cities of Hebron, Bethlehem, and Jerusalem in the Judean highlands. The most important valley is Ajalon in the north, but the most storied is the Elah. The Elah was where Saladin faced off against the Knights of the Crusades in the 12th century. It played a central role in the Maccabean Wars with Syria more than a thousand years before that. And, most famously, during the days of the Old Testament, it was where the fledgling kingdom of Israel squared off against the armies of the Philistines. The Philistines were from Crete. They were a seafaring people who had moved to Palestine and settled along the coast. The Israelites were clustered in the mountains, under the leadership of King Saul. In the second half of the 11th century BCE, the Philistines began moving east, winding their way upstream along the floor of the Elah Valley. Their goal was to capture the mountain ridge near Bethlehem and split Saul's kingdom in two. The Philistines were battle-tested and dangerous, and the sworn enemies of the Israelites. Alarmed, Saul gathered his men and hastened down from the mountains to confront them. The Philistines set up camp along the southern ridge of the Elah. The Israelites pitched their tents on the other side, along the northern ridge, which left the two armies looking across the ravine at each other. Neither dared to move. To attack meant descending down the hill and then making a suicidal climb up the enemy's ridge on the other side. Sample complete. Ready to continue?